welcome back to my channel if you're new this is today with star i am star today it's time for another episode of crock pot tuesday so for today's episode i'm going to be making stroganoff stroganoff is so good it's a family fave let's get crock pot cooking so first we're going to start with our ingredients we have uh, one whole diced up onion some worcestershire sauce Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire sauce. So good. You can also use this to make barbecue sauce. And I use two cans of golden mushroom. Gives it lots and lots of delicious flavor. And then like a pound, two pounds, however much meat you really want. Um, cut up of like, I used London broil steak. So you can use like beef chuck steak or whatever. You just two one to two pounds depending on how many people you're feeding all right let's get to it so we're just gonna put it all in the crock pot except the meat so we're gonna add the onions the soup and the Worcestershire sauce in the crock pot and then we're gonna mix it all up and make sure the flavor is there and then once all the flavor is in there we're gonna add the meat in I also salt and pepper the meat to ensure the meat is fully seasoned and flavored you don't want plain meat then it just kind of throws the whole thing off I like well seasoned meat all right, let's get it all in the crock first. One whole onion. Two cans of the golden mushroom soup. And you want three to four tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce. You can even use more if you want. It's all on your taste preference. It's just a really good, it's a really good flavor to have. And just mix it all together then we're going to add in the water and the meat with the meat I just added some salt pepper a little bit of Worcestershire sauce just to mix it all in with the meat and a little bit of onion powder now I'm just going to mix it all up in there and then I'm going to add half a cup of water all right so I'm just going to add the half a cup of water and mix it all in all right, and that is it for right now. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the crock pot on low. I'm gonna put the lid on. We're gonna let it cook until I get back from work. When I get back from work, I'm going to add one eight ounce package of cream cheese. And then I'm going to cook some noodles and then I'm gonna add the noodles to the crock pot and we're just gonna mix it all up together and it's gonna be so delicious. All right, I'm gonna go to work and then when we come back, we're gonna do some more. All right, and now I am back from work, so we're just gonna check on the crock pot and make sure everything's cooking nicely. Then we're gonna add the cream cheese to the crock pot. So I'm gonna add between eight and 16 ounces of cream cheese. It all depends on what, or how much cream cheese you want and what's your preference. We like a little bit more cream cheese sometimes. Um, and then we're gonna go ahead and put the noodles on the stove and get the noodles started, yeah. And then I'm gonna throw some steamed veggies in the microwave and then tie it all together. Let's get checking on stew. So inside the crock pot, it looks really nice and delicious. Mmm. This is what you're looking for. Now we're just gonna add the cream cheese. All right, let's add the cream cheese. Yum, yum, yum. When you add the cream cheese, just gonna mix it up. You want to break it up a little bit. Okay, so as you can see, there's still like chunks of cream cheese in there. And that's fine. We're just going to put the lid back on and we're going to let the cream cheese slowly melt in with the sauce while we wait for our noodles to finish cooking. Alright, so now all the cream cheese is nice and melted. Now I'm going to add... The bow tie noodles. You can use any noodles you want. These are just what we chose for tonight. Um, traditionally, or most people use um, egg noodles, but I don't like to use egg noodles because they get soggy really easily. They do cook fast and they work perfectly with this dish, but they just um, they get soggy too fast, so I just don't like to use them. So yeah, you're just gonna mix it all up. Oh, I'm about to die. Hi 
guys and that is it for crock pot Tuesday this week I really hope you enjoyed my stroganoff recipe it's so good we love making it right, so if you like this video go ahead and give it a big thumbs up it really helps me out a lot if you are not subscribed go ahead and hit that big red subscribe button and if you want to be notified of all my future videos you know you got to hit that bell and if you are already a subscriber thanks for subscribing and i'll see you next time bye guys wait a minute baby going too fast i'm gonna turn back